been up all night. I haven't gotten any sleep at all. Anyway, I was watching, not just now, but earlier, or last night I watched the movie Pearl Harbor. I haven't seen that in a little while. But I just, I was going to say something about it. It's been a little while since I've watched it. Or I was exercising afterwards. I had some laundry in the wash and the dryer I was waiting for. I've wanted to do a next scene in my movie, but, or take a walk, but I don't have any clean socks, I wore dirty socks today, plus I've been wearing these dirty clothes, I had some clean boxers, but I wore the same shirt and the same pants I've worn the last two or three days, maybe even I think just, I don't know. Anyway, what I was going to say about the movie Pearl Harbor, I've seen it before, but it's been a while. And I don't want to sound unpatriotic. Or, you know, what I mean, it's like, I say stuff about the government, or, you know, different form, the system, which... I think if you don't think the system is stupid or doesn't work or messes up people's lives and pretty much is not there for your benefit, then I think you are stupid or I won't say stupid, just like uninformed or, you know, naive. But anyways, that movie, it was good. Yeah, I hate... I mean, I don't hate the Japanese. I mean, I... You know, the point of that movie... I mean, that's not the point of the movie. But I'm saying, you feel the hate for the Japanese. But one thing you've got to understand about American movies is they're geared towards making America look good and other countries look bad. You know what I mean? I'm not saying other countries aren't bad. Well, I don't think any country is bad. There's bad people in power a lot of the time. But that's a tricky thing about war. Whatever side you're looking at it from, it's going to look good. Or do you know what I mean? It's going to look like it's the right side. But there's really no right side most of the time. A lot of wars are just fought over someone wanting something, you know what I mean? It's our country or other countries feel like they have the power to take what isn't theirs. And a lot of times, well, I don't know as much about other countries, but I know our country takes a lot of what is theirs, you know, they because they're powerful, they feel that it isn't theirs, and other countries aren't just going to lay back and take it. They're going to fight back. Or you know what I mean? It's not like... We... What they do, or what any country does to us, might look horrible, or, you know... Because we see people, innocent people dying... But over in other countries, innocent people die from the American army, you know? I mean, I'm an American. I'm, I guess you would say, on America's side. But at the same time, I don't just go along with, um, you know, I question things. But it is hard, because you can't really, you have to kind of pick a side, but you don't really think that that side is necessarily good, because there's bad on every side, but I hope you understand what I'm saying, I'm not trying, I mean, I said a lot of things about the system and the government and stuff, and I think a lot of everything is f***ed up, and most people do, it's because it is. 
But what I'm saying is just... You kind of have to understand, I mean... You can hate other countries that attack us. Which, I guess that is... I mean, because you ha kind of have to... But, at the same time, you feel something for... If you really looked at it from their side, you would feel something for them, too. Do you know what I mean? It's like, war is so tricky. Like, comedians, some of my favorite comedians... I mean, I don't know if it's just one of them or some, a couple of them. They said, America is a gangster, or like, gangsters. Because we take... Or, you know, if you don't give us what we want, we take it. I mean, that's... It's... America just kind of... Doesn't, you know... Take no for an answer. I mean, I'm sure other countries don't either, but... I'm just... I live in America, so that's the most I know about. I mean, I hear stuff about other countries, I watch stuff and everything, but you know the most about your own country. And that's the side you'll see things from, unless you want to look, or you know, it's kind of good in life to look at things from all different sides. Because, or else you'll be very narrow-minded and blind to reality or the truth. But I just, I was just thinking about that with that movie. I mean, I am not siding, I mean, that's just a movie, but I'm saying I'm not siding on the Japanese side. I don't think we're still at war with Japan. But... What I'm saying is, like, you just, I mean, if, I didn't even notice this, I don't think, before, when I watched that movie, like, when they're talking, when the Japanese are talking, at the beginning of the movie, they're talking about how America took all their oil, or they were about to run out. I didn't even notice that before, you know, because it's not... They're speaking another language, and you read, I mean, everyone reads the titles, but they don't pay a lot of attention to it. Or maybe I don't, but I was just, you know, because you, you get caught up in the love story of movies, and you miss, you know, important facts or whatever, but then sometimes you catch them after you've watched it. Or, you know, one of the times you're watching. But I just saw that, and I was started thinking about it. But yeah, he, everyone gets angry, you know, when they see the Japanese, or I'm just referring to that movie, when they see, you know, Japan attacking all the American soldiers, and the ships and everything. But that's the way the movie is geared toward you know, what I'm saying. Anyway, I'm gonna do my next video. Set everything up. I'm just gonna do one video. Oh, one more thing. Outside the room, there's like this, something on the floor. I don't know what it was. I keep stepping on it and I hate it. Because, you know, in the beginning of the movie, I wore one sock on one of my feet. Well, I had duct tape on it, but I had, like, um, planners work. So, I mean, I don't now, but... See? I, but it hurt so bad, and it was hard to dance. I had to... Um, it was only on one of my feet, but I'm, like, sometimes I get scared. I like being barefoot sometimes, but I get scared that I'm going to get that. But that was... 